Hey, oh, this is Dash. Yeah. yeah. All right, so before we get off on our way, some of you guys might be wondering how and or what is going on with the whole cleanup from the devastation, <laughs> the destruction that happened when we got all of that rain a couple weeks ago. It's been about two weeks, <clears throat> actually almost three, and I see that Frederick is open. So I'm gonna go ahead now, Frederick. But they have been repaving and, and doing a lot of the cleanup necessary to get this back up and uh, back up the way that it should be. This is fun for me. We're not even really far from the house yet. Go ahead and ask your question again. Is, he's trying to figure out where we're going. He's, he's never been there. Is the restaurant in like a TV show or like a movie or something? It's been featured on TV shows before. Like like Bizarre Foods or something along those lines? Mm, not sure if it was on Bizarre Foods, but it may have been on diners, drive-ins, and dives. Maybe. I don't know though. I can't I really can't remember, but I know for sure it's been on it's been featured in TV shows in the past. Okay. More guesses? No, I just think still. Okay. When you have another guest, let me know. I'll pull up the camera. Oh. Now. <clears throat> All right, so <clears throat> here we go into the hustle and bustle of Lexington Market. Now, the place where I'm trying to go, I actually think it might be out that way. But we're going to see. So come on. <laughs> Come on. Over in the line. <laughs> okay. So now, look up there on the menu. Alright, so now, I know for sure. I'm getting a soft shell sandwich. What do you want? What do you want? I mean, you can see what's up there. All right, fine. I'm ordering your crab cake. What? What do you want? Hurry up! Shrimp basket. Oh, yeah. Shrimp basket. I don't even see a shrimp basket. Oh, all right. Shrimp basket. All right. We can get your shrimp basket. That's all right. So I decided to just order two lump, or oh, actually two soft shell crabs, and then we're gonna split a lump crab cake, and then have another surprise for you too. Uh huh. So those are the lump crab cakes back there. So we have a. Uh, Lump, and that's back then. Oh, what? Say that again? What? Oh, yeah, buddy. Time for experience time. Nope, I guess they're putting me to work too. Look at that right there. Thank you. Uh, all right, so now the next part is you come over to the raw oyster bar or the raw bar and you get your oysters and your clams. 
So we're gonna get some oysters. I'm getting a beer. Alright. So we're gonna get uh get a boiled egg, hard boiled egg with it. So we're gonna split this up. And I don't know if you wanna stand over there or if you good right there. Alright, so let's see what we're gonna get. We want go ahead, pick them out. We want half a dozen. See where it says uh primes or mediums? You see the sign right up there? We don't want clams, we want oysters. Alright. So we're gonna half a dozen oysters and we'll start with the Alright. You got this? Yeah. Gotta eat the oysters first. Maybe. We'll see. Sure enough, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> oh man, best in town, right? Good stuff. <laughs> they said they say so. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Slide over just a little bit. Yeah. No, we had the bomber. We had, we had something down here, though. We had, what do you think? We had the bait fruit bomb. Like that. Yeah. And then we had great. the pioneer. Yeah. No. I'm not really in the frame, but that's okay. No, focus more on him. But. Uh, Social crab, you eat the yeah, entire thing. There it is, isn't it? The whole one, WWF. Stick with me, kid. Who's the napkin? Mama's gonna be jealous. I would be too. Well, my cousin's daughter got married. Hot sauce is good touch. Hot sauce is good touch. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Excuse me, sir. Can I get a half a dozen uh oysters to plant? Oysters. My man, can I also get a natty bow? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Goldfish. Uh, Goldfish. 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 So good. Come on, oysters. In the box. But they shuck them for you, right as you stand here at this bar. We're ready to eat. All right, so your thoughts on the uh, crab cake? It was amazing. It was well, like seasoned and tasted good. Uh huh. Yes, indeed. Big lumps of big lumps of crab meat that was really good. It was like cracking open the claws all the time and just getting like. Did the, did the great like, it was amazing. Alright. So now we're moving on to the oyster course. And when you get oysters down here, they give you what well, you can ask for eggs. So we're going to go to since you probably never used that before. I thought I used it. Yeah, I'm trying to clean the no. eggshells off of the plate so I can put that egg no, back on there. I probably only needed to order one egg, but we got two. So you have your own, and I have my own. Here, I'll keep mine over there. You put your egg on the oyster. I'm telling you, it's the, I'm going to say the craziest thing, but when we came down here, Mommy and I came down here, and we saw folks eating eggs on oysters. They were like, you know what, let's try it. Now, I'm a finish. All right. Thank you very much. So, all right, perfect. So we just got our oysters, and you get <clears throat> get your lemon, horseradish, crackers, and you have this. Can I get a hot sauce, please? Thank you. Oh, can you get it? 
Oh, he's got say excuse me. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Alright, and the hot sauce. Hey. Hot sauce. Look, and we even got some smoked. I think I'm gonna use some smoked hot sauce. Alright, so now you get three, I get three. Go ahead on, make yours up. So I would advise. I don't know. Anyway, go ahead on. You got three, I got three. If we need to, we'll order some more. Why are you taking it off the plate? Just leave it where it was. Dress it up and then go ahead and get it, go to town. You know what to do with, with, with the uh, oyster? You the right man. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, I think you own a business tip basically for itself on a down low. Yeah, he's still conducting business, man. Here, use the fork. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Right. Two beers. Yes, ma'am. A uh, natty bow. No problem. Mm -hmm. Don't be afraid of it now. Come on. Do you know how to use hot sauce? Like, like, there you go. There you go. Come on. All right. Don't worry about it. The egg's not going to make that much of a difference. <laughs> there you go. You're welcome. It doesn't make much of a difference, does it? Yeah. You all afraid of the egg? It's just a hard boiled egg. Then what is it? It's odd. Okay, well, no worries. You don't have to eat any more of it. I'll eat it. All right, well then, go, go ahead on. You got two more. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna go ahead and finish our lunch and uh, we'll walk around a little bit before I leave out. So I've gone ahead and dressed mine. I used the smoked Tabasco. And I put the egg on there and a the horseradish. How about the, how are they? The eggs okay? Yes, sir. So what did you think? So these were definitely the biggest oysters I've had. Uh -huh. I've had quite a few oyster oysters. And they were very, very cool. Nice and fresh, right? Nice, chilled. All right, so all right. We'll try it again. You know, we gotta get out here. I'm putting my egg up on there. Tabasco. With the full leg of the regular Tabasco. What's the name of Lana or whatever? That's a hell of a that's a hell of a relationship. <laughs> that's a hell of a relationship. Alright, what am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something. Huh? The egg? I got I have the egg on there. The be a first lady. Yeah, I have the chip the chipotle tabasco. Did you get the, the cocktail sauce? Oh, you know cocktail or whatever they are. Ready? I don't feel like at all. Oh, so good. So good. I would agree. I would like more, but I don't know. Did you find them? Word up. No. He says no. You think he would have been like, yeah, daddy, sure, I'll treat you? Mmm. So, come on. <clears throat> I come down here, I go to Fraley's. I get myself a soft shell crab. Come on, go down to the right. Get a soft shell crab. And uh, mommy usually gets a crab cake. That's it. Well, you know what? Mommy wanted me to get some turkey legs. See, those are already smart. Smoked, though. But a lot of prepared food, Chinese food. So this guy's got poultry over here. Let's see if we can find some turkey legs over here. Right. Mommy wanted me to smoke drumsticks, so I'll get get a couple of them. Golly. All right, look, that's good. I'll take it. Oh, 
Buffalo Bills. We got sausage, smoked meats. Oh man, what is that right there? What is this? Looks like a piece of ham or something. This ham. Hog mog. This ears, but no, those are butts, tails. Man. Alright, let's keep walking. Oh. Alright, let's find a bakery. <clears throat> Get some cake or something. What cut is this right here? Oh, look at the deli. What is that right there? Country ham. That is country ham? Okay. Oh man, it smells amazing though. All right, come on. Ooh, more smoked meats. So we are about to head out from the Lexington Market. How was your first experience at the Lexington Market? It's awesome. And Fraley's, Fraley's is, Fraley's, Fraley's, I think is how it said, is where we primarily go. So, would you want to come back again? Definitely. <laughs> of course. Next time uh, we coming back, you're paying. All right. You cool with that? If I have the money. Oh, all right. So we didn't walk in the, the other building, and I don't know if this was the original Lexington Market and the one across the street is the newer one, but it's dead on this side. Man. But we'll walk down, all the way down to kind of see, but we got music stuff, fruit and produce, supposedly, meat. Another raw bar. Meat and oysters, three seventy-five. But they're they're less expensive than Fairleys. Ah. Sub shop, tobacco outlet. Whew. Yeah, they're definitely way cheaper than on the other side. But the other side is pretty much where it's at. <laughs> There's nobody on this side. There's some soul food over here. Angie soul food. Alright, I think that's about it. And then, yep, that's about it. Alright, so, that was fun. Yeah. Thank you for rolling with a brother. No problem. Alright, so what we had today, you had soft shell crabs for the first time. Enjoyed that, didn't they you? Were good. They were good. I'm a big fan of soft shell crabs. If you don't or haven't ever had soft shell crab, it is, you know, crabs molt. They go from having a, uh, when they get bigger, and they they release or crawl out of their exoskeleton, and then they're soft shelled. And it is phenomenal. You just eat the whole thing. Everything. It's great. I mean, like, when I eat crab, I've, I've been always told to, like, not eat the lungs and don't eat like anything that's not meat, but Rem with the soft shell crab, you just eat everything. Remind me when I get home to show you, there's a video of a guy I saw eating the crab. He ate everything. Everything. He, there was nothing left on that crab that he didn't eat aside from bits of the shell. Like, remind me to show you that video. I, I was impressed at, at the dude's ability to eat the entire crab. Thank you very much for tagging along with us on this vlog style type video. I'll see what I can do as far as the edit. I don't even really know what I'm going to do as far as editing this one. But I just wanted to experience that or I wanted him to experience going to Lexington Market. If you're ever in Baltimore or if you're in the Baltimore area, I highly recommend going into the Lexington Market. Um, don't be afraid of all of the negative things you hear about the Lexington Market. Those elements are here. But just look past it, really look past it. Go to Fraley's, get yourself lump crab, uh, yeah, lump, a jumbo lump crab uh, crab cake or a platter. Definitely get a soft shell crab if you've never had one before. 
sit at the oyster bar, <clears throat> get some oyster. Well, get some. Yeah, well, we we got oysters. I'm, we've I've had clams from there before, and I've rather oysters over clams. Okay. And and last but not least, don't forget to get yourself a natty boat. It's like, oh man, oysters, cocktail, the egg, beer, oh, man. It's like, it, oh. anyway. Thank you again, as always, for watching. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. If you like what you saw today, if you learned something, leave me a thumbs up, and I'll see you next time.